Hello, everybody, and how are you all doing today? It's Rusty Champagne here with you, and I hope you're having a wonderful day. We're back once again in the world of Center Station Simulator, uh, continuing our way through the tutorial. When we last left off in our last live stream, we were getting ready to build another big piece of machinery that was going to take longer than the live stream was going to allow. So we were going to run back down here and we were going to build a tube furnace. That was kind of where we left off. So that was kind of where things were. So if we open up this tube furnace and if we go here, it is down here. This tubular furnace takes a main block, two chassis, an outlet frame, a reservoir, four resistance, four central tubes, and an outlet tube. So it takes a ton of stuff, basically. That's kind of where we are, is that we got a ton of stuff that needs to be built. And now we're just going to see what all it takes. So if we kind of set this up, then the question becomes, where the heck do we even want to set it if we do set it somewhere? So let's see. If we were to set this up, how big of a thing is this thing? This is, uh, and if we rotate it, what is the front? So what is the front of it if we look at it? It is, uh, it looks like it kind of goes, uh, so like this bracket part is on the right. Okay, so if we look at that and if we set it up with the bracket part on the right, oh man, this thing is huge. Uh, where can I even put it? Uh, um, hmm. what is it even going to do? Uh, all the mysteries. I don't know where we set this thing. Uh, short of moving a whole bunch of stuff around. Um, can it go somewhere else or do I have to build it down here? I'm guessing I got to build it down here. That would not make any sense for me to have to build it or for me to be able to build it anywhere else other than down here. So, uh, huh. Let's see. If I wanted to try and build it here, could I? I could, but then I'd have to move everything around over here, and that would be kind of messy. So uh, maybe I'll put it... Huh. I'm, I'm really trying to think where I want to put this thing if I set it up, because it's, uh, it's a monster of a thing. Maybe I'll set it up like this and try and set it... Eh, boy, this thing is just huge. Um, I might have to maybe consider rearranging some stuff here if I do this. So let's see, if we were to rearrange stuff, how would we even rearrange it? Because maybe I put it on that wall, because it would fit on that wall, but then I'd have to move everything that's on this wall to another wall and make this happen. So let us do our destructo gun a bunch of times. So we're gonna go here, we're gonna do our destructo gun, and then we're gonna move all this stuff here. So I'm gonna take this, I'm going to pick it up, kind of set it over here, and drop it down. And then we're going to take our destructo gun again, and we're going to oh, we're going to destructo gun this, and uh, where we go? There we go, and we will destructo gun you. All the flashy thingy. Okay, so all this has been destructo gunned. So now we're going to take this and we're going to move it over here, and just going to set it here. And then we're going to take this and we're going to set it here. Okay, so now we got all that. So, whoa, man, I'm going to turn on my flashlight because that's what we do. So now we can get our giant tube furnace. And we're going to set it on this wall. And that looked like it was the front. Okay, so that looked like it was the front. And right about there. Yeah, how far over can I get it? Like right there. Okay, so there's the giant tube furnace. So now we got to kind of move other stuff around. So where can I set this stuff? So this crusher, I guess I can set. So we're going to build the crusher. And let's take the crusher and build it right over here. So all the stuff that has to get moved around. So crusher we'll put right here for now. And then I can grab my crusher box and grab it, set it here. Drop it down, right click and whoa, and E. And E. Uh, you are not working. So let's set you down. I wonder if the box is too close. Is that what the issue is? Maybe the box is too close. So right click and E. There it is. It was just the box was in the way. All right. And E and E. All right. There we go. So that's there. So now I can move this ingot out of the way. I'm going to set that right about there. And now we're going to set up our, uh, we'll set up our workbench and we'll set it over here. Oh, no, that's not the workbench. That's the saw. 
So we'll set the saw maybe uh, next to the workbench. Let's see. Can we fit it in there? Let's check. So the small saw cannot go there. So it can go here. So Or it can go here. So I'll set it here. Uh, we'll set it right about there. We'll do that for now. And then we will grab our box and drop it down here. And then we will once again right-click in E. Uh, and now it's in the way. <laughs> Something's in the way of this. Uh, all right, let's drop this down. And maybe we got to move the box again. So we'll move the box and pick that up and set it there. There we go. Right click and E. And 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 right click and E. All right, there's that. Now we've got our plastic. Um, uh, refinery. So I hope I'm going to be able to set that right there. Uh, will that fit? Yes. Is it because the ingots are in the way? Maybe. Is that the issue we got here? Uh, let's see. Maybe it's the ingots. So let's, uh, well, no, not that. Uh, return to play. And let's uh, do that. So now let's move the ingots around. So many things. Okay, uh, close that up. There we go. And now let's move the ingots out of the way. So you over here and you over here. And just get all the ingots out of the way because maybe they are blocking the pathway. So let's do that. So all of this going on. And all right, so that's there. So now let's try this again. So build. And the this is going to be our refinery. Now can we put it here? Uh, I should be able to. Why can it not go there? Is it just, is it bumping into stuff? Uh, where can I set it? Do I need to move? I guess I got to move the water machine over. Okay. All right. So let's uh, take, get rid of that and get rid of that. Okay. But I don't want to move the water machine because I already did that before. So, uh, ha. Uh, let's see. Where, where can I set this? Just so many options of things that I'm going to move. And I don't know where to put anything. Because uh, that really should work there. So, all right. Let's, so, I guess we're going to destructo gun this. Okay. And then we're going to uh, put that away. We're going to grab the water. And we're just going to set the water down here. Just wrap that right there. Okay. So, now let us grab this. And let's move this. All right. So now we're going to get everything nice and snug. So the water machine is going to go, uh, What? which one was that? The water bottle machine is going to go there. Uh, and that's the, yeah, that's the front. So just because I had it to, what is it? Okay. So it can go there. Now let's take the refinery and let's put it um, next to it. There we go. Now we got everything. It all fits. It's all good. Okay, so now we can take this and right-click and E. And right-click and E. And right-click and E. And right-click again and E. And right-click again and E. Okay, now we got that. So now we can get our, our uh, refinery. And I can do this probably a little bit faster by bringing the box over. So let's do that. Let's bring the box over. Okay, and drop it. And now right click. Oh, go away. Don't stay away from me. And oh gosh, now the box is too close again. Uh. <laughs> okay, box, you back there. Okay, now you there. Okay, everything's a little finicky. It's fine. It's fine. We're good. So we're just going to right click. No, don't pick it up. Drop it. Right click, E. Right click E, right click E. There we go. Now I got my pivots, my energy efficient pivot. Everything's now in place. Perfect. So now for this monster thing, now that we've done all that, wasted 10 minutes rearranging the basement, what do we need for this thing that we are trying to build? This giant tubular furnace, a main block. So let's start with the main block. Let's see what we need. Let's hit the uh, button for no reason. So the main block of the uh let's see of the tubular furnace needs four iron ingots a motor and a cable so we're going to need a bunch of iron so let's just start with that so 
So the next thing we're going to do, we're going to go up and we're going to just, uh, we are going to start mining like crazy. So we're going to go up here. We're going to take this. We're going to mine our lives away and see how much, uh, how much coal we can get. And hopefully we can get a bunch. That is the goal to get a lot of coal. So let's hope for the best here in terms of getting coal. So let's drop this down and let's get our pickaxe. And we're just going to mine like mad. Hope for coal to drop out of here because we really need a lot of that in order to have better operating furnaces. Because I don't run, a, I don't want to keep using wood in the furnace if I can avoid it. So we're going to just see how lucky we get. And so far, I've not gotten lucky. I've seen the things blow by my face, and none of them have been cold. So, yeah, we're going to just have to do this for a while. I've got a feeling. There was one. And so, yeah, I think we're going to do this for a bit. And let's see. Yeah, I've gotten one piece of coal so far. So we're just going to keep on. There was a second one. So if I can get like three or four, was that a third one? Nope, that was not coal. So I can stand this far away. That's good. And I can see a little bit better. And if nothing else, I'm going to have all kinds of stuff that I can run downstairs. So I got that going for me. And how much do I have now? I think I've got four. I, I feel like four fell out. Now how are we doing? Or has that all been copper? I've got a feeling it's all been copper. Let's see. There's one. There's another one. I've got all this other stuff and none of it is coal. Oh, gosh. There's a third one. Let's just get one more. And we could start doing some ingots. There's a third one. And how about another one? No, cobalt. I don't really need that. And we've got uh, that's something. And that's just some more of something else. And yeah, I'm, I'm going to have a whole floor of stuff. And there's some coal. Okay, so now we got four coal. I can at least get a little bit of stuff started here and run this down. So let us see what all we're going to need. And I really need to be able to get that thing updated so that way I can start getting coal out of that machine because that's going to make life a lot better. So we're going to take the coal. We're going to drop this here, and we're going to empty it out. And then we're going to grab four. Nope, that's copper. Okay, that's not going to help me. So we're now going to run back upstairs because, oh, yeah, I need iron anyway. So, yeah, so we got to go up here. we got to grab all of our iron, and we're going to do that. So let us grab our iron from here and see uh, how much of that we have here. And hopefully we have a decent amount, although I'm not seeing much. But let us drop this down. Uh, you look like iron. You are iron. Yeah, I, you are iron. Okay. And so are you. And so are you. And so are you. And I feel like there's another one in here. Is there? There's that all copper. That looks like it might be a lot of copper. That's copper. So we might just have the, uh, we might just have that. Okay, so we've just, all right, that's all we got for now. So we're just going to have to keep on mining like mad. Oh, oh yeah, I can turn on the, uh, I can turn on the iron ore machine. And that'll give me all the iron ore that I need. So let's turn on the vending machine and get that rolling. So start and you can make all kinds of iron, hopefully. And that's not eating into our power. So that's good. Our power is okay. So we'll get a bunch of iron going from that. So we're going to drop this and right-click this a bunch of times, get all of our iron here. So we're going to take this. Nope, we want to get the iron in first. We want to maximize all of our coal. So all the iron is going to go there. Okay, so that's four iron ingots. So I might just end up making a bunch of ingots first and seeing how many ingots I need in order to do all this. So there's some coal. There's some coal. Uh, here's some more, and one more. There it is. Okay, so there's all that. Now, while that's going on, I'm also going to go over here and harvest all of our wood because uh, we need all that harvested, so that way if I need more wood, I can get more wood. So we're just going to harvest all this, make this all happen, and drop that, and one more. We got all the seed packets everywhere. So let's replant all of these. Uh, replant, please. Uh, pick it up. It's that easy. Just got to click on it. It's not that hard. Okay. A fifth one and a sixth one. Now, 
Look at all these seat backers we got. We got them everywhere. Okay, that's all rolling. So while that's rolling, what all do we need? So we've got this. So all these pieces are here. That's a concrete mixer, so tubular furnace. So we're going to need uh, six, eight, uh, let's see. So four, six, eight, ten, twelve, um, and then a bunch of copper. So 14, it looks like. So it looks like we need 14 at least. So we're just going to keep on doing that as much as we can. So it's just going to be a bunch of iron ingots, I think, in order to get this done. So we're just going to have to keep on getting as much iron as we can. Let's run upstairs. Actually, let's get this. Or do I have any more iron here anyway? I guess I can do some copper while that's happening. So I'll wait for these to be done. Drop them down. Put in some copper because it looks like I'm going to need a bunch of copper anyway. Okay, so let's uh, turn on my flashlight. And let's get these dropped. And get that one dropped. And get that one dropped. Okay, while that's going out, we're going to make a bunch of copper while we can. So we're going to maximize all of our fire as, as well as we can. And then we're going to run upstairs, grab all of our copper. So we got to just try and maximize our time the best that we can here um, with everything that we got. So we're going to run upstairs grab a bunch more iron hopefully from our iron vending machine let's see how we're doing here how many we got here we got seven that's good so we'll run here go to our iron vending machine take all of that and we're going to throw it all in here just like that so we got even more and a few more uh, let's see five oh now i gotta get close and six and there was a seventh one. I thought I hit seven. I was sure I hit seven. Maybe I did not. So one, two. There it is. And another one. Okay, let's take it all. So there's nine. So that's good. So there's a third one and <laughs> or an eighth one and a ninth one. Okay, let's run all this. Oh, there it is. It dropped on the ground. I see. Okay, you tried to get away from me. Ha <laughs> ha, I found you. Now let's run this downstairs. And let's take this. Okay, so now we've got uh, copper ingots getting ready to go. So they're almost there. So let us get these. And let us see once they are done. Uh, hopefully, yeah, the, the coal is always the trouble. It's just having enough coal to try and get this done. So we are going to um, get this. Once this coal is ready, we will get this out of here. Or this copper. Okay, so copper out, and let's get this emptied out and replace it with iron. Okay, so more iron in, and copper out, and iron in, and copper out, and iron in. Nope, nope, don't drop it. Put it in there, and then copper out, and iron in. Okay, so there we go. So now we got iron and copper happening. So let's take a look at this again. So we need a couple of motors, a few cards, a few cables for the fix. No, that's for the milling machine. So let's go back to this. So motor cable. So we need uh, motors, cables. So not too much then. So a few motors and a few cables. So, okay, and then the motors and cables are going to be iron and copper. So how many motors and cables do we need? So I need one motor, one cable. So I need uh, two iron and a copper to make this part. And then four iron ingots. So let's, uh, let's get a motor and a cable going right now. So motor, manufacture. So we're going to take one of these irons, one of these coppers, put it in here. And there's that. And then the copper... Take that, put it in there. There we go. Take that, drop it on the ground. And cable. So cable. Manufacture. Grab another copper. And we're going to grab that, put it in here. And then take that, put it on the ground. Okay, now we can make the first part, the main block. Manufacture. So this is going to be four more iron. Okay, so we got one. We're going to take that, put it in there. There's one and two. Take that, put it in there, and three, and put it in there, and then four, which is right there, ready to go, and then the motor, 
and the cable. That is done. Let's put this on. That's going to go way over here. One piece done. Whoa, we ran out of power. Ugh, doggone it. Let's run upstairs, turn on the power, and uh, then we'll be fine because that will turn off the other machine outside, and that's all I need. I don't need that machine on right now. We're all good. So let's take these out, and let's put in more iron because I'm sure I'm going to need it. So let's do more iron because I've got it right here, and the fires are still burning, so let's keep those going as much as we can. So, oh, this is like a rat race, and the rats are winning. All right, that's good. Now, so the base is built. So next up is after that, we need the uh, frame. So that's two iron ingots. So let's manufacture that. So the frame is going to be two iron ingots. So one right there, and two, and the fire went out. That's fine. And there. So that is going to go here. And did it? Oh, it went there. So how many of those frames do we need in order to have this? Uh, that's not what we want. So uh, escape. So how many frames do we need on this thing? Is it two? It is two chassis, which is, I guess, the same thing as a frame. Okay, I'm glad I looked because the other one looks like it goes right about there. So, all right, all the fires are out. All right, so let's use some of our wood, put it in here. Uh, this is going to be faster than using the coal. I know. It's uh, it's not the most efficient, but it's what we got to do. So we are going to just keep rolling as fast as we can. Just running, running, running as much as we can through this. Okay, are these ready to go? They are. Good. All right, let's get all these out and throw them all in this corner right over here. And that's good. So all this right here, and then we can get it replanted. And the, the soil's still good. It's uh, And there's my flashlight. Okay, let's replant these in here and get some more wood going. It's, 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 the, it's the race against time that I'm putting on myself. So there's one and one. Okay, so now we need uh, another frame. So let's do another one of these frames. So manufacture. So this is going to be two iron ingots. One is already out here. So one is here. There it is. And then we need one more. And where are you? Uh, one of you is going to be done here pretty soon. So we will wait for one of you. And hopefully we're going to be able to get this thing done. I'm feeling confident about it. What it's going to do, I don't know. But we're going to get it built. All right, there it is. Iron ingot into here. And you go over here. There it is. So there's two of those. Perfect. That's done. Next up on the list. Now we need an outlet frame. Two more iron ingots. There it is. Okay, that's going to go right there. I see it already. So let's take this iron. Let's put it in because I'm sure we're going to need more. I have no doubt we're going to need more. Oh, I can't put any of in because we need to take the iron ingots that are here. Okay, so there's one. Uh, iron, you go in there. All right. And you go in there. You go there. Look at us roll. We are running like crazy. That is that part. Next up, uh, the outlet tubes. I don't know how many of these we need, but I think it's a bunch. I think that was the thing that we needed a whole bunch of was those. Uh, outlet tubes. How many did we need? Uh, one. Oh, and only one. Cool. Okay, that's worse. So uh, let's go here. Outlet tube. And we need uh, that. So two more. Uh, go away. We don't need you. So two more iron ingots. And there's a... Oh, no, we don't have anything. Oh, I have no... Oh, shoot, I have no more iron. Is that iron? Yes. Okay, perfect. So you're in there. And then one. And you're going to go there. And then... Uh, do I have others going? Meanwhile, while that's happening, let's run back upstairs. And let's go to our vending machine. And grab whatever iron it spit out before we ran out of power. So let's see. what. How much do we have in here? We have seven. That's good. I will take all seven and bring that downstairs because that cannot hurt to grab all of that. And a couple of them fall. There's my flashlight again, just in case. And we got a third and a fourth and a fifth and a sixth and a seventh. There it all is. Run! Back downstairs we go. It's a race. I don't know why, but it is. So we're going to take this, drop it down, 
1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And do, 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 do. And that one's done. Okay, so that's good. Take that, put it in here. There's another piece. Next up, this is where we need four. Okay, so this is going to be eight iron and eight copper for this because we need four of those tubes, if I remember right. Yes, four of the central tubes. So eight iron, eight copper. All right, that's fine. We can make that happen. Go away, book. We don't need you. Okay, so we are going to put more wood in the fires. Again, it's not the most efficient, but I don't want to waste my time going and getting coal right now because uh, that's uh, we're, we're trying to do all this uh, just running like crazy in here. Okay, what is in there? Uh, okay, so we've got how many iron do I have? Uh, this will be four. So there's one. Okay, so that's going to so this is going to be five. So I'm going to have five iron and then I'll need all the copper. How much copper do I have down here anyway? Four? I only have four. Okay, so I'm going to wait for this iron to finish. And <clears throat> once the iron finishes, I will run upstairs and get the copper. And if I manage to get coal while I'm getting copper, all the better. But we'll see how we do. But right now, I'm just kind of waiting for these to finish up. Because this one will be finished. And then I can put another one in. And then we'll... Okay, that one's done. Drop it. Let's grab another one. Put it in. So that gives me six. Okay, those are going to take a bit. So while those are taking a bit, let's run upstairs. And let's go to our mine o randomness And let's see what we're going to get over here with our magical ball of handling. And uh, we are going to see... Oh, I do have copper here. Never mind. I don't have to worry about this. All the copper into the ball of handling. Let's go. All of you in the box. All right. There's another one and another and another and another. Okay. Back downstairs we go. I've got all the copper I need. Life is good. So we're going to just keep running. I just felt like running. And back downstairs we go Shoo, through the doors and drop it like it's hot and yeah none of these are, oh that one just finished okay so that's going to be six so number seven is in there and then i think i only need one more i've got what one two three yeah okay so i got four on the ground and four in the ovens all right so that's okay so that's all of them so now i can grab copper and start doing copper copper everywhere that's fine we're good so there's one copper. Okay, so everything now is copper. That's all I need to know. And I shouldn't have thrown the copper down by the iron because now all I'm going to do is confuse myself, um, which is fine. I'm, I'm used to that. So meanwhile, let's go over here. Let's get this going. So we need manufacturer. So we're going to grab an iron. Uh, do I have any ready? No. So I've got nothing ready in there. So iron and iron and copper and copper there we go so there's one so one of these is ready put it in this magical wonderful machine whatever it is there's the one that we put in so there's one there's another iron drop it and copper in and then so we're going to uh let's see are any of those close to ready they're not okay so i can get another one of these going so back here, another tube, manufacture. And now we're going to go here again. And iron in here. And another iron in here. So now I just need two coppers. Everything's going to be copper from here on out. So more wood on the fires. So we get all the wood going. And I'll probably be able to harvest some trees. So we'll make all that happen as well. So we'll check out our trees. See how they're doing. I'm sure they are probably good and ready. So how are our trees doing? Are you ready to be plucked? Yes, you are. But now the, oh, now all the plots are dry. Ugh, that's unfortunate. So the plots have dried out. So I will have to focus on that as well at some point. So, but for right now, I'm not going to worry about that because I do have enough wood down here for now. So I will worry about that another time. So there's uh, another iron. So you out of my hand get replaced by a copper 
and you're going to go in there. And here's a copper, so you're going to go down there. So, and then I think I need another copper. I'm sure I do. So I got one, two. So I got one on the ground. I've got four in there, so that's five. And I think I need one more. Yeah, I should only need one more, and that would be my six. Yeah. So yeah, because there's four there. So four iron for the others. And then I've got one, two, three, four, five. So I need one more piece of copper in there. And, okay, so you go in there. Okay, so I've got, I'll need actually one more after this. Because all those have copper in them now. Okay, so there's one piece of copper. Okay, so I've got five more that I need. And four are in here. Okay, drop that. Let's get another piece of copper. Put it in there. All right, there we go. Grab that. And we're going to take this and take this put it in our magical machine bang there's two now let's go over here to this manufacture a third one and grab some of our iron so there's a one and let's see do i have some more copper that's done here no 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 those are all still cooking okay there's that meanwhile while these continue to cook let us uh run and grab some, I really wish I could use that water to water the plants. For all I know, you might be able to. Uh, perhaps it's possible. But we're going to go just run upstairs, grab our bucket. And we're going to turn on our magical water machine. So turn you on, start, and close you up. And let's grab some water and run downstairs and refill our magical planter boxes. And we'll see how we're doing on all of this at the same time how is our copper doing okay so that's all i got was one okay so uh copper and that goes in there and copper that goes in there okay there's a third one so now all i need is two more pieces of copper and we're good so just two more pieces of copper and we'll be fine so one more of these to be manufactured so iron and I think I got two coppers in there. Yep, I do. So there's my last of my copper for this part. <laughs> okay, iron. And iron. And copper, which is right there. And one more copper, which is in the hopper. There it is. And take that, put it into our wonderful machine. Boom, that part's done. Next up, what do we have? So we just finished those. Uh, tubular furnaces for resistance. And how many of these do we need? I think it was two. Let us check. Tubular furnaces of resistance. Four. So we need eight more pieces of copper. That's doable. We can do that. So we're going to just get a bunch more copper going. Okay, so now this is where I'm going to go and rewater all my things. So we're going to run upstairs. Going to do a bunch of rewatering. Can you fill it with the water bo up bottle up here? Why not? That, that, that you should be able to. I mean, they've got that right there. Oh, so demanding. All right, so let's run, and we'll do this five more times. Do 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 do. Um, stop. There we go, and four more. And at some point, I do need to do my bamboo. I know I need to do my bamboo, and I need to start making storage. Um, and at some point, I will do that. Right now, I'm not focusing on that. Right now, I'm just focusing on getting this machine built, whatever this machine's going to be. Um, because we're going to have all these fancy machines, and these fancy machines are going to do fancy stuff, whatever it is. I don't know what it is, but it's going to be fancy. That's all I need to know, is that it's going to be fancy. So there's number four, two more. And then we'll plant all of our seeds. We'll get more wood going. We'll throw some more wood on the fire, and we will have, and I'm going to probably need to get more copper on top of that, because I don't think I have enough copper down here. So I might have to go and do some mining as well. So let us take a look at that while I'm at it. So how much copper do we have downstairs? And I will get the wood going. And while the wood's going, I'll take a look at our copper supplies. Okay, so there's that. Let's plant all of these. Oh, put that away. We don't need the bucket. So plant and plant and plant and plant and plant and plant. There we go. Okay, so how much copper do I have down here? Uh, you are all copper, right? So we got four, and we got six, because you're iron. You are not copper, so you're going to sit right there, away from all the copper. Okay, so I need two copper, 
And then whatever coal I just happen to get while I'm getting my copper is gravy. So we're going to go up here. We're going to get two copper, and whatever coal we find is bonus. So let us do this. Back to the, the gentle dinking that we do here. So let's see what we get. All the gentle dinking. And that's not copper or coal, so that's a lose. That is also not copper or coal. That's aluminum. I really don't need aluminum right now. I really could use either copper or coal. That is a uh, copper. That's good. So how about one more? And that'd be nice. Uh, that's a coal. I'll take that. Coal's good. And another coal. That's even better. So if I could get four coal, I'd be... Oh, look at that. Three coal. I'm all about this. And a four... Oh, man. Maybe we're going to go on a coal craze. I could handle this. Uh, I'd be all about this. So we're just going to kind of keep thinking. Okay, there's five coal. I'm liking this now. And six? Oh, no, that's another copper. Okay, that's fine. So we'll put away our, our hammer of dinking. Oh, no, go away, cobalt. We don't want you. Um, not right now we don't. We'll want you eventually, but right now we don't, we don't need you. Um, all right, all the coal into here. And now we run. Take this downstairs. Then we will come back for our copper. So much running. So much running. We're in such good shape. I really hope our grandfather appreciates what we're doing for this abandoned shopping center where delivery trucks can't come, but people can for whatever reason. Don't question it. Just got to think fourth dimensionally. That, it, that's always what it is. Just think fourth dimensionally. It's all going to be fine. Uh, grab your, your ball of handling. Let's take this back upstairs and get our couple pieces of copper and keep going because we're, we're getting closer on this machine. I don't know what we need after this, but we're getting mighty darn close, and that's kind of exciting. So let's drop it and grab our copper. There's a one and a two, and now run! Back downstairs we go, and yeah, I really cannot wait until I can get that thing cranked up so it can make other things. I really want my vending machine. <laughs> Give me my vending machine, and they could do more than just iron and stone. Okay, so drop that and empty it. Nope, drop it, empty it. That's what we want. Okay, copper in there, and copper in there, and your iron. I have set you over there for a reason. And copper in there, and copper in there. And now some coal right there, and some more. And get those fires burning. Keep the fire to burn, and let us keep it. Let it keep us warm. The world will keep on turning. And, uh, okay, there's my other copper right back there. So, now, we need two of these resistance tubes. And then after that, we're going to need two iron, a card, a motor, a cable. So I probably need plastic. Yes. I definitely need plastic because for the card, we need some plastic. So I get to get some plastic going. And a gold, copper, silver. Okay, that's fine. That That's good. So, plastic. Uh, plastic machine. I have no plastic, so let's get some plastic going in our plastic machine. Turning wood into plastic, one log at a time, because these woods are these pieces of wood are apparently both timber and plastic. It's again fourth dimensional thinking. So let's run back upstairs. Let's grab our silver, grab our gold, bring it back, because we're going to need it for the card. So let's run and grab that. I really wish we could run faster. Um, but we cannot. So drop it like it's hot. All the gold in here. Bam, bam, bam. And all the aluminum and cobalt that just is going to sit here and be like, what about me? Um, it's not your time. It will be your time. It's not your time right now. Don't be envious. It'll be okay. There will be times where we're like, where's all my cobalt? Why are you not coming out? And then it's going to be sitting around going, ha ha, now you need us. Okay, gold. Uh, one, two, three. And I do have silver. Uh, so I don't need the other silver. Yeah, I don't need it because I only need to make one card. So ball of holding will go over there. And copper. And copper. Okay, drop them. And let's grab some more copper. Uh, maximize the use of our fires. And more copper. And drop that out. And drop that out. And now back here we go. More copper. So I'm going to need even more copper, which I knew I was. I absolutely knew I was. Um, there was no doubt about it, but I just I had to see what we were going to do with this piece. Okay, so we got to get uh, the uh, resistance thing built. Uh, 
doohickey. So one copper and two copper. So here we go. Number two. Oh, oh, wow. That's right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's right. It's only two pieces. Oh, so I only need four copper in total. So I'm good. Oh, sweet. Happy accidents. I love it. Okay. You in there. Bang. Uh, in there. In there. There it is. Okay. So we need one more of those. Oh, perfect. Wow. That, that, that was unexpected. Yeah. Copper ingot times two. Uh, but, oh, but we need four of them. That's right. That's where it came in. Okay. I'm still a maroon. All right. That's fine. I knew that. Um, nothing has changed. All right. So there's one. And there's two. And we are going to put that in. And yep. So we need two more of those. Okay. That's where this all came to be. Now I'm with it. I'm back with it. So here's number three. And so this is where we're going to need more copper. Uh, we're going to make this happen. I promise. I know we're going to do it. I have confidence, full faith and confidence in us. While we're at it, we might as well go and take care of some wood because we can always use wood. Uh, it's going to go flying everywhere. That's fine. I'm okay. I know you can build wood storage. There's my flashlight, just in case you were wondering. Um, yeah, I know I can build wood storage. I will eventually do that. Right now, I'm not going to worry about it because I want to build this machine. I am singular, I'm single focused on building this machine. Okay, let's do this and this and this. And we're going to take this one that's right in the planter and plant it because it's like, plant me. And I'll be like, okay, I will if you insist. All right, wood there. And now copper. There's a one. And drop it in. And a two. And drop it in. And there's that. And while I'm at it, I'm going to go over here. And I'm going to make a silver and a gold because I know I'm going to need them. So there's a gold. There's a silver. Let's get that happening. And then we're going to go over here. And we need one more of these. So manufacture. And here's a copper. And then we've got that. And then one more. Yes, there it is. So there we go. And throw that in. Really, this is, it is feats of science that we have going on. Now, finally, the final piece. Two iron, a card, a motor, a cable. So uh, a motor is an iron and a copper. And a cable is a copper. And then that is a copper, silver, and a gold and a plastic. So I need three copper. Um, I'm going to need three iron. A silver and a gold. So three copper, three iron is where I am because I need two iron for the piece. Yeah. So three copper, three iron, a silver, and a gold is where I am. So, and I only have one iron. And I think I turned off my vending machine. So I can uh, go ahead, put this iron in. And then, uh, all right. So we got to run back upstairs. Let's uh, check out our vending machine, see how our vending machine is. Did I probably turned it off. Uh, is it off? Uh, yes, it's off. So um, I can turn it on. Let's see if I can turn it on and not have it blow the power. Oh, shoot, it blew the power. Okay. Um, I'm going to still have to turn on the power anyway. So oh, that's unfortunate. So let's turn on the power, and let's go clean off our solar panels. Uh, well, we don't have the water on anymore, so that might help us. So... Uh, yeah, it's always this one that gets dirty for whatever reason. I'll never know why. And this one actually got dirty. Wow, the one on the end got dirty. Holy cow, that's new. Okay, so now we can turn on our vending machine again. We will let it start vending. So you, vend me some iron, please. I would appreciate it. Okay, let's take our ball of holding. Run back here. So I need three copper for sure. Any iron is a bonus. Um, any coal is a double bonus. Uh, anything else is a whiff. Okay, so let's do this. And we've got coal. That's a double bonus. I love coal. And there's a copper. Nope, no. Oh, yeah, that was a copper. Okay, so there we go. So we're going to stand over here and see if I can watch this stuff fall. That was silver. Don't really care about that right now. That was more silver. Don't really care about that right now. Um, that was aluminum. Really don't care about that right now. Um, that was more aluminum. There's going to be a time, come a time where I need all this aluminum and all this cobalt, and I'm going to be very happy for it. There's a second copper and another coal. Okay. And uh, a third copper. Okay, perfect. So let's take that, throw it into our ball of holding, our three copper right in there, and we'll run back, 
and then we will come back and see how our iron machine is doing. How's the iron vending machine doing? Is it giving us iron vending machine? Yes, we got all the iron we need. Perfect, just like that. Zip, right through the doors, right downstairs we go. Fires are out. I knew that was going to happen. That's fine. Um, I'm going to drop that. I'm going to grab our silver and our gold. This is the gold, not the silver. Uh, this is the silver. So we're going to grab that and set that down. Okay, now we're going to grab our wood and put it in here. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Do this. Make, make efficient use of this. So copper and copper and copper. Make the most efficient use of the wood. That's what we want to do. Be efficient as much as you can. So, all right, so more wood here. And thankfully, we phase right through our magical ball of holding because it is magical. Okay, so, so we just need a copper, and then we can make the cart. We need a plastic. So let's grab one of our plastics, put it in our cart. So we're going to drop that, and you're going to go here. going to make our card manufacture. It's going to be our gold, which smoosh and smoosh and plastic smoosh. Okay, and a copper. Uh, you're in iron, so we'll just set you down for now. Um, uh, what else can we do? I'm kind of looking around. Uh, what else? Let's take this gold and kind of set it over here. That'll work. Um, hmm. What's it going to be? What's it going to be, boy? Uh, I think we need... Oh, yeah, we need our iron. Let's go up to the iron vending machine. That's what I can do. So we'll go and get that. Always on the move. Never stopping. No wasted movement. That's what we shoot for. Okay. Vending machine. All the iron. Let's take it. All of you out the door. Here it is. And into the ball of holding. All of you in. And can we grab you from there? No. Uh, can we put you in? Yes. Uh, can we make this happen? It's like one pixel, but I can find the pixel because I'm just that lazy. And we're going to keep on moving it in until you force us to move. Uh, you still have not forced us to move yet. Still have not forced us to move. Oh, now I picked up the ball. <laughs> so, all right. There's 11, 12. All right. Run! Back downstairs. Something's ready by now. I'm sure of it. I'm sure that copper's ready to go. Okay. Drop it. And all out. There you go. It's going to fly everywhere. You're going to sit on top just like a good little boy. And that copper goes there. And that goes on the floor. It's, it is, we've got it all clean in here. Just trust me. And then we need a, a motor. We need a motor, right? Yes, we need a motor. And we need a cable. So we're going to manufacture a motor. So it's going to be with our iron. Why am I doing this? Put the stuff in. Put the stuff in. We need all the iron. Put it in the foundries while the fires are burning. Make the most out of your fire. So there we go. Iron. And what did I put in there? I think I put in a copper. Oh, I hope I got that right. Oh, boy. What do I have here? I've got two copper. So, uh, yeah, I put an iron in. I'm almost positive I put an iron in. I want to say I did. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, yeah, I believe I did. Yep, I must have. Uh, okay, and then we need a cable. There we go. And that's going to be the other copper that we got in here. There it is. And we're going to drop that. Okay. And then, finally, we need the... Uh, the reservoir, so that's the card, the motor, the cable, and two iron ingots. I think we're just about there. We've got another piece. So there's a cable, the motor's already in, the card's in, and finally, two iron ingots. Uh, that fires out. I'm not even worried about it. Uh, that fires out. I'm not even worried about it. These two I need running. So we're just going to let these run, and then that will take care of that. Huh, okay. So two more iron ingots. And we will just be about done. And then we're going to see exactly what the heck a tube furnace does. Because I don't know. It's just part of the magic here at the abandoned supermarket in the desert called the Rusty Cart. You just never know what's going to come next in this place. It's magical. It's mysterious. It's like Wally World. That's all I can tell you. We're all in the family truckster on our way to the coast to ride the roller coaster hoping that john candy is not there to tell us that the park is closed all right
One piece of iron. One more piece of iron. Uh, get in there. Get in there. Do it. There it is. Oh, my goodness. This is going to be magical. Oh. Use the E key on the tube kiln screen to view the resources needed to produce asphalt. Start asphalt production. So we need some stone, sand, and clay for asphalt. Three crushed stone and one sand. Okay. We can do all this. So three crushed stone and one sand. And we need all the power. This is where it's going to be very important for all of our power. So we need a couple of stone. Uh, go away. And then a sand. And we've got a sand outside. So we're going to go get a couple of stone. And we can get that from the stone machine. Oh, and we got tons of sand. we got all the sand in the world. Okay, let's grab some stone. Uh, just a couple. All we need is a couple. So just a couple out of here. One, two. And take those. And take those. All right, we got to turn this machine off. Otherwise, we are definitely going to blow a fuse. So stop. We don't need you anymore. You're good. You've done your job. All right, stone, stone, and run that back downstairs. And we're going to get you crushed. I crush your head. Crush, 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 crush. Okay, you go into the stone crusher. Where did I put the stone crusher? Right over there. That's where I put it. So drop it, and out you go, and one of you into the crusher. You're going to do your thing, and while you're doing your thing, I'm going to go run, run upstairs, and I'm going to grab some sand. I only need one sand, I believe. So let's grab a sand, and okay, and I think I want to start this back up again. Uh, there you go. You're running. You make your sand, and downstairs we go, and then I think I can take this and put it into the thing. Can I? Okay, let's just set it down for now. Let's not get cute. Okay, here's a crushed stone bucket, and then we need uh, our other stone. Let's throw that into our crusher. Okay, so now let's go to this. Three crushed stone and one sand. So I guess we put it in here? Possibly? Let's hit start see what happens. Um, nothing. Okay, so we've got to probably put it in. So let's see. Uh, sand. Do we just put it on? Do we just touch this thing? Yes, that's all we do. And stone. And stone. And where did my other bucket of stone go? Papa was a rolling stone. There it is. Wherever he laid his hat was his home. All right, start. Oh, no. Ah, uh, what else can I turn off? Uh, gosh, that eats up all the power. Uh, okay, uh, power. Lights. Okay, let's run up. I'm sure it's because I ran myself completely out. Um, yeah, because I know that takes up all the stuff. Okay, uh, clean. Uh, no, clean. Clean. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that's going to eat up all the power. All of it. I know the next thing he's going to have us build is going to be a solar panel. I know it. I just, I, uh, I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Okay, one more time. Uh, don't go out on me this time. Okay, here we go. Three crushed stone and a sand. Start. Yes! It stayed on. And it is now uh, doing its thing. I think it's going to do its thing. I'm pretty sure. Is it? Is Are those lines going down? I'm looking. Okay. Uh, all right. Let's uh, step away. Oh, yeah. It's working. I see all the lights. It's going to come out here. I'm pretty sure. Uh, look at the magical machine. Uh, it is a magical tube doing magical stuff. And it is very exciting. Don't be... But don't look at all the red on the power line there. Uh, no solar panels are allowed to get dirty right now because we need this thing to finish. So don't run out of power. Just please don't run out of power. Um, don't don't get dirty any of your solar panels. Don't you do it. Don't even think about doing it. I should probably run upstairs and check on them. But why would I do such a thing? Let's do it anyway. Just while that thing's cooking. Because I don't know how long it's going to take to cook. And I don't want the solar panels to give me any issues. So I'm going to go over here and just give them a quick hit anyway. Even if they are clean. I'm going to hit them anyway just to make them doubly clean. So there we go. You're cleaner. You're even cleaner than you were before. So are you. And so are you. All right. You're all clean. All right. Run back downstairs. This is exciting. We're getting ready to make asphalt. Um, as far as I know, I think we're getting there. Uh, you're still cooking. Man, that takes a long time to cook. Absolutely a long time to cook. Let's take a look. How's that looking there? Uh, well, I know you're working. 
I, the question just becomes, how long does it take for you to finish? So, yeah, we've started asphalt production. I, I think we have. I, I thought we did. So, yeah, I'm hitting start a bunch. And I'm just interested because it hasn't said anything about wait for it to finish. So, yeah, so we're going to stand here and we're going to look. look. Look at the way the rocks glow. That's kind of cool. We got that going for us. So, I think it's working. I'm guessing it's working. We're just going to kind of sit here and look. Uh, hopefully it's doing its thing. And if not, we will kind of take a little peek at it. But as far as I know, it should be working. We got three crushed stone. I thought I threw in three crushed stone. Yeah, that looks like we got three crushed stone and one sand. That absolutely looks like we got three crushed stone and one sand. So I'm going to hit start again because why not? We're just going to keep on hitting it. Maybe I need to stop hitting that. Maybe that's what's causing it. Um, okay, well, we'll sit here and we're going to wait. And we're going to see what happens. And uh, we'll, we'll come back when it is finished doing its thing, potentially. Hey, so future Rusty here from the editing room. So it's about this time that I'm now going to run upstairs to grab some more sand buckets because I'm thinking that maybe the issue I'm having downstairs is the fact that I don't have enough sand in the machine. But the thing that I don't realize while I'm doing all this is that I don't have my microphone on because I had muted it to, of course, take a drink of water and never turn my microphone back on. So I'm doing all this stuff and my mic is off. And that's why I am now here as future editor Rusty to let you know about all this. And then I come back downstairs and lo and behold, I have all of the buckets of cement that have now been produced while I was upstairs running and getting sand. And so now we then reach the point where the next thing I have to do is actually take the sand upstairs to the parking lot, which is what we are going to do next. And so here's Future Rusty once again from the editor's booth because at this point my mic is still muted and I still don't realize it as I am doing this. And now we have our three buckets of asphalt. We are trying desperately to figure out how to take this asphalt and get it into the ground to actually make a parking space. And as you can see, we're having all kinds of difficulty with it. And it will be very, very soon that we will then realize that we do actually have our mic muted and we need to do something about that. Okay, I just realized that in the process of all this, I've, I've run upstairs and I had my mic off because, of course, I did. So um, it, do it doesn't matter because I'm still trying to figure out how to get all this up here. Okay, all right. So apparently hitting E all over the place is how you get the buckets of cement to, to work. Um, and I realized that I was muted there for a while. So you uh, probably didn't see that I ran up here with a bunch of cement. And apparently this thing just keeps on creating all kinds of cement. Uh, it, I didn't bring it up here. That was just here. So you have to like find the, the proper place to hit E for the cement to go in. I don't know why that is, but you just have to kind of keep clicking until it, it hits. And then you will you will have it. So I'm just going to keep clicking here. There it is. Uh, your first client is on the way. Oh my goodness! You're you're seriously? He's on the way. He really really is. Is this really true? Is this really happening? We're going to just get out of the way, and we're going to see if this is true. Because I don't feel like this is true. But I oh there it is. We got a car. We have a car. Oh my goodness, we have a car. Here he comes. Oh wow. This is big. Uh there he is. How you doing, sir? You're going to come on in. I don't know what this machine is for, but you're coming in. I'm going to come to meet you. I'm going to leave my I'm going to bring my buckets with me. And I'm going to wait for you to come in the front door. Uh, this is exciting, folks. This is very, very exciting. We're just going to go right over here with our buckets of stuff. And, oh, my power went out. Okay, let's turn on the power. Uh, he's going to probably want that. So let's turn on the power as well. Okay, and back in we go. And lights! And that's, oh, shoot. Uh, we got, oh, man. 
Uh, I got to turn. Oh, all these are dirty. Okay, so let's uh, clean all these up. All these are dirty. Okay, there's one. There's two. And there's three. All right, those are all clean. Now let's try turning on our lights. Uh, join the shop checkout. So use the E button on the cash register. Wait for a customer. Use the double F click of the... Okay, uh, that's a lot of things. All right, let's put away this. And now we're going to go to the cash register. Where is our client? Is he still on his way? He must still be on his way. That's all I can figure. Uh, it's a long walk. I realize that. It, where are you, sir? Are you still walking? Are you on your way? It, have you already come in? You must already be in the store. Oh, there you are. Uh, how you doing? It's a long way around. Okay. Uh, checkout. Here we go. E. And then we uh, use the E button on the cash register. Wait for a customer. Use the double left click of your mouse on the object. Okay. Uh, yeah, I, I'm sorry that you're walking so far. I wonder, can I clean up this floor? Because this looks messy. Can I do this? Oh, wow, look at that. Floor looks superb. He walked all the way through the store to get all the way over here just to buy some water. Um, that's a long way to go, sir. But I do appreciate the fact that you walked all this way. Uh, are you even getting any water? Do you already have it? Is it already in your bag? Hello there. Uh, hello there. How are you? So double click on this or single click and double. Uh, do we click on it again? Oh, thank okay. You, goodbye. Uh, thank you. And you're gone. And we got a, we've got a buck. <laughs> we made a dollar. Oh my goodness. We've made $1. It's exciting times. We've made our first dollar in the game. I'm going to sweep this up and I'm going to sweep this up. We've made a dollar. Can I put that in a plaque and hang it on the wall? I really want to know. Oh, wow. This is big. We've made a dollar. We're, we're in the money here at the Rusty Cart. So that is going to be all for this one. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, I'd appreciate it if you gave it a like. If you really like this video, I'd appreciate it even more if you consider giving the channel a subscribe. But until we meet again, thank you as always for being a part of all of my silliness. I'm Rusty Champagne, and we will see you later.